Welcome back everybody, I'm CryptoNobs. In today's video, by request, I'm going to be talking about Cardano and my thoughts and price prediction on it. If you guys take any value or enjoy anything I bring to you, any feedback, uh, like or subscribe is greatly appreciated. Or if you want me to talk about any other cryptocurrencies by request, uh, I'm always keen to listen to you guys. Uh, with that, let's jump straight into the video. So if we take a look at the current market cap, it is at $175 billion, which is a big increase compared to the past few days. Um, the market is showing a very good recovery at the moment, which I am pretty impressed with considering the rest of the stock market um, is going down as well as everything else going down. Uh, but today I'm going to be talking about Cardano. Now if we have a current look at Cardano's price, it's trading at $0.29. Cents. It is down 4.17% for the day. Uh, its overall chart, so if we have a look at its chart over here, uh, if we have a look on the 30 day, it doesn't look bad. Oh, it does look bad, sorry, but everything's been bad. We can't say it hasn't been because everything's been affected quite uh, big over the past few days because of the coronavirus outbreak. Um, but here's the thing with Cardano. What is Cardano and what, are you, what do you guys want to know about it? Cardano is a decentralized public blockchain and cryptocurrency project and is, full, is a fully open source. Cardano is a developing uh, a smart contract platform which seeks to deliver more advanced features than any protocol previously developed. It is the first blockchain platform to evolve out of the scientific philosophy and a research first driven approach. The development team consists of a large global collective uh, of expert engineers and researchers. Now, I've been invested in this uh, market for um, just shy of three years now. I think it's two and a bit years, but I think it's a coming close to three years. Um, now, I do personally own some Cardano. Um, I bought some Cardano because when I was looking at it back in um, the last bull run, basically... Um, I saw it did really impress me, um, as well as Stellar Luminous um, and a few others. There were a few others that caught my eye, but Cardano uh, was one of the ones that I actually decided to add to my portfolio because I did like the look of it. Um, but I haven't uh, been up to too much date with it recently. But here, here we are. We're going to keep. We're going to bring it back by request because, um, for all I know, I might want to put a lot more money into Cardano because what they do want to do is a lot. Uh, it is doable. And it can make a big, big difference uh, to a lot of people. I just want to bring out some news uh, based off uh, Cardano and the coronavirus. Uh, Cardano founder uh, Charles Hopkins denied that Cardano Shelley's update would be postponed due to the COVID-19. Um, as you can tell by a lot of things, everything is going into lockdown. A lot of things are being uh, delayed and stuff like that due to this lockdown. Uh, proof of stake blockchain Cardano has been working on it. Uh, implementing commercial infrastructure and has recently uh, reassured the public that the development is on schedule. Charles Hoskinson, the CEO of IOHK, the firm behind Cardano, said that the updates on the implement, uh, implementation will be out in upcoming months. Now, I want to point out a few things. This is what I personally think will happen. Now, I follow quite a lot of people on Twitter. And these people are respected. You, I'm sure some of you guys have heard of Anthony Pompidano and uh, $100 trillion USD, um, Plan B. Um, basically, what these guys are saying is that the Fed, the government, they are pumping an unbelievable amount of money. Now... I'm no expert, trust me, I'm no expert, but here's what I personally think is going to happen. Now, I've been saying to my friends over the years, uh, over, let's say the last 100 years, $100 would get you quite far. But compare it to now, it gets you pretty much nowhere. You can spend it in seconds. But 100 years ago, $100 was actually, it was worth a lot because considering houses were worth anywhere between 3000 and 10000 now that they keep pumping and pumping and pumping, the more money that they keep printing, um, the the less valuable the pound, the euro, the dollar, it all becomes because they keep printing more of that circulation, uh, more of that currency. It, it makes it less valuable. Now, what I think is going to happen is, I think a lot of bad things are going to happen over the next, let's say, month or two. 
I reckon it's going to get. I reckon it's going to get slightly worse. A lot of people are going to lose their jobs, which is what we've already started seeing. Uh, you're going to see hyperinflation. You're going to see really, really big inflation of uh, prices as well as stuff like that because what the the government have created is a big, big bubble. Now, what they've been doing it that long now that they've burst this bubble, and this bu- bubble could be the biggest burst in history purely because our grandparents would have gone through a similar sort of crash in 2008 our parents would have gone through us a crash or we would have gone through a crash and now it's 2020 and here's the next crash and it could be the biggest crash in history because this is the last what i like to refer to as the last squeeze out of the toothpaste there's nothing left in there they can't do it anymore and they're desperately trying to pump it all now i think what will happen is is we'll take a parabolic flip uh, an, e- an economic uh transmit uh flip basically i reckon it's going to get worse before it gets better and when that happens i think we're going to see a new monetary system now one more thing i want to point out in two uh in november sorry china america and japan all announced they want to go digital and then in december the coronavirus comes about maybe a slight coincidence but i personally believe that this is what is supposed to happen for it to be able to come into play basically now um cryptos like cardano they are certainly interesting as well as uh, some of my other videos you would see uh, i'm invested in ethereum i'm invested in Chainlink. i am a, a big believer of the crypto market and it's a case of if the crypto market in the next three months can prove us all right then i'm personally i'm going to be going all in now I want to do quickly whilst I end up this video. If you've guys made made it this far, and uh, then props to you, I really appreciate it. But I'm going to do a price prediction for Cardano. Uh, what I reckon it could be by the end of 2020. And now with Cardano, I reckon the potential it does have the same with any of the other cryptocurrencies in the top 20. Um, pretty much, I believe Cardano could see 10x. I reckon majority of the cryptocurrencies in the top 30 could see 10x. And what has to happen is we have to have this parabolic flip where everything changes. And I personally think this is what a lot of us have been waiting a year or two years or three years for. And yes, it is bad for the world. And a lot of people are going to suffer, which I do feel bad for. But I think this is what has to happen enable for a new financial system to come into play because they have abused it and they have ruined it and it's out there to everyone that they have abused and ruined it so if you guys taken any value from this video i've been crypto nobs uh thanks for watching peace